So what is up? We are uh, looking for some streams. What's up guys? We're trying to go find us some tri. Today we'll be combing the woods for creeks that may contain trout. We're looking for streams. We're looking for creeks. We're looking for streams and creeks. We're looking for trout. We know nothing about trout fishing, but we just watched a YouTube video, so. Let's go. Part of trout fishing is hunting for these creeks, okay? And these these creeks, they they hide good, all right? They're evasive. They don't want you to find them. <laughs> same with these little streams, creek streams, same thing. Right there. Cousins, water, water, water. I'm gonna catch you. We might have a potential creek. We're about to drop into the DG. And we want to show you this really cool sign. The DG. And a cool sign. Yeah. Wow! Right on. Where's my mask, dude? Where's my mask, dude? <sighs> it's beautiful, huh? Nice vibes. Hey guys, I just wanted to show you this sign real quick before we go into Dollar General. A it sign. says, have a happy day. So I hope all you guys have a happy day now. Yeah, super happy day. See it? Take it all in. I like the little moon down there. That's cool. Nice. Whoa. <laughs> Almost dropped the phone there, peeps. All right, we got bags flying. We found this little pull-off area. We're hoping we can get to some more water. We don't know what it's called. It is right near <laughs> right near the Frewsburg, New York. Right near the Florida. Taking a dump, it says. No taking a dump. Okay. No taking a dump. So like we said, we've never been here before. We're not really sure what to expect. Looks like you gotta walk down this trail and then maybe we'll find some water. Maybe. <laughs> I hope so. <gasps> ah, there's prickers over here. We're not sure if we're even gonna find the water over here, guys. He sees water! You see water? Yay! We're actually gonna try to fish now. I got mud in my shoe, but that's okay. Rocking the cracks. Oh man. This looks like the spot, dude. Yo, the spot! I'm just gonna fish jump right over here. Did you seriously? Yeah. Yes! Oh, looks like people have even had like a fire down here before. That'd be cool. Now we gotta try to be quiet. So we're gonna okay. Fish. Gotta be quiet, guys. <laughs> We're gonna get set up here. We'll be back in a few. This location here is so beautiful, guys. I highly recommend coming here if you're looking for like a nice, quiet area to fish. John's trying to get me a little trout setup going right now. <laughs> we did find some bobbers. We were worried we didn't have any, but thanks to us over buying stuff last year, we're ready for this year. <laughs> Look at all the stuff he's got. Look at that thing. What is that, the Flex Phantom? It's crazy. The Phantom. The Phantom. Oh, we some little hooks and stuff for the trout. Some bass stuff getting in her mix there just because I got all kinds of bass stuff. Yeah. 
Shout out to my dad and my stepmom for getting this chair for us for fishing this year. We may pick up a second one, but I can confirm it's very comfortable. Isn't that right, John? For sure. I like it a lot. <laughs> All right, so briefly in that uh, bead fishing tutorial, you know, they made like a little bobber setup kind of like this with little stopper beads and stuff. I don't have stopper beads, but I had some weights. Try to configure something. Kind of looks deep for this place. It looks deep and murky. Um, she wants to go with a worm right now, though. We're not going to start her off with a bead or egg or whatever. We're going to do a red worm. Yeah. She's going to cast this sucker. We're going to cast it. Get in there. And let me back up here. Yeah. Watch there we out. go. All right. All right, not bad, not bad. So far, we haven't really had any bites or anything. If you can see all the way out there, that's my bobber just chilling. We have switched to mealworms, so we're hoping we get a bite. Please drop a like if you're uh, enjoying this video and please subscribe. We have seen the water splash a few times though, so we're pretty certain there's fish in here. They're just hiding at the moment. Comment down below if you've been fishing here before and did you have any luck? Sorry guys, we still haven't caught anything. I'm hoping this isn't a fail. I'm hoping we can pull out a fish for you, and if not, I'm so sorry. What the hell is that on the end of it? You got like a dingleberry. Woo! Nice. Look at that distance, mate. So we've kind of came to a conclusion. We think we're going to finish this video off with a fresh... A fresh Fruz Burger pizza. It's some honey mustard thing. It's gonna be crazy. Um, yeah, recommended <laughs> by Sam. Apparently, it's a uh, golden pizza. Yeah, it's like the golden pizza. It's recommended by one of my BFF, Sam, and I'm super excited to try it. There you go. <laughs> so I just wanted to show you the outside of the Fruz Burger real quick. John's about to go in and pick up our golden pizza. Yeah. yeah. Look at John all masked up with our golden chicken pizza. Guys, we ordered four blue cheeses and it's Ken's blue cheese. Eesh. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, John. I'll still be happy. This is Buffalo, New York style blue cheese, so maybe. <laughs> maybe it'll be maybe okay. It'll be okay. I'm, I'm about ready to go somewhere else just to get some blue cheese. So I can... We gotta stop at another pizza joint just to get some blue cheese, or what? Go to Lena's? Gotta go to Lena's just to get some oh homemade blue God. cheese. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's sick. All right, let's go. So we went and got the pizza, and then we came back to this spot that we we're fishing at. We figured this would be a great place to try the pie. Let's get all that blue cheese off. Let's take a look at what she looks like. Let's take a look. Moment of truth, people. <gasps> what? what? This looks crazy. So it looks like it has chicken tenders, cheese, possibly some buffalo sauce, or maybe it's the honey mustard sauce. Yeah, this is like golden. Yeah, it's a golden pizza, y'all. Wow. Oh, man. I'm gonna draw mine now. <laughs> Look at that. All right, let's go. Oh my god. Yo. Dude, this tastes like honey mustard wings. Mm. That is crazy. I've never had a pizza quite like this. Dude, it literally is a golden wing pizza. Look at that. Oh, that yummy honey mustard, the cheese. Mm. Okay, so that's good. And the breading. Okay, I like the crust. Mm -hmm. It's a little on the crispy side, but I like that. Take it. Now, sorry for the camera work. <laughs> now my next concern here is this blue cheese. Is it gonna be up to par? We don't know. Here's your blue cheese cup.
I don't know, man. It smells tangy. <laughs> it smells kind of like ranch. This smells good. It's Sorry to talk with food in my mouth. It's better than the other Ken's blue cheese we've had. The flies are attacking us. They want the pizza. Thank you, Sam, for recommending this to us. Yes. I'm gonna have to say blue cheese is not, um, it's, it's, it's just, it is what it is. But <laughs> the pizza, the pizza. The pizza, what we came for. The pizza is fire. Mm -hmm. And the blue cheese is workable, okay? Don't get me wrong. It's, it's just, seriously not bad. It's just not, it ain't that homemade blue cheese, but that's okay. I'm fine. I can get over that. I can get over it. Because the pizza's good. Ironically, we don't think the Fruz Burger actually sells burgers. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think they just sell like pizza wings, subs, pizza logs. <laughs> Where's the friggin' burgers? Pizza at the Fruz Burger. <laughs> we. So at this point, there's no napkins. <laughs> We're trapped in the woods. We're not going to be able to drive the car home. Oh, that's greasy. That's really greasy. Yeah, that's greasy. Anyway, the pizza's banging. Sorry we didn't catch a fish. It's early in the season. We're not trout fishermen, and this is not probably the best trout spot either. But, I mean, I didn't catch any bass either, so... I don't know what's going on, but anyway, it's early in the year. We're going to put out some more fishing vlogs. We're going to eat some more food you know we we're, we're, our faces. we're gonna do a bunch of cool stuff this year uh so you know make sure you stay in tuned and if they're doing festivals out here we're gonna be there so look out for us if you're out here in the western new york say hi to us say hey hello what's up we'd love to see your faces hmm we'll say hi back we'll like, hey. like hey hey <laughs> look how beautiful it is out here guys And that concludes another Jamestown vlog. And I left some crust for the raccoons. Because raccoons need crust too. <laughs>